This is your host, Andrea Dumbecki. Are you ready to connect with the magical realms of the angels and fairies? We'll be working with the magical realms to bring enlightened consciousness to all areas of our life to increase abundance, health, and happiness. Look forward to weekly shows with your host, Andrea Dumbecki from angelfairyhealing.com. Hi everyone, on this week's podcast I will be talking about angel time travel or working with the angels to heal ourselves throughout time and space. Um, We can work with the angels to heal karmic issues, to heal issues from this life or to bless our future. Um, We are eternal beings, we have had many experiences and we hold the trauma and the memories of all of our experiences. We can work with the angels to neutralize with love all of the energy that we are carrying in our being. When we work with the angels, the angels are on such a high vibration of love and healing that they bring calmness. They remind us of our true identity as a divine child of God, always loved and safe in the universe. So let's take a moment now to open our heart to our angels and set our intentions for our time travel healing. Um, You can bring up any kind of phobias you have or any issues you think you may have from past lives. Um, Past life issues can come up as just kind of phobias in this life or or issues we may face repeatedly with like uh, people or money or health. Um, So just kind of bring up any karmic issues you feel like you may have, any soul challenges you feel like you're working through. Also think about your childhood, any traumas or issues with your childhood that you would like to bring healing with or your adulthood and also any fears about the future. So we're just going to hold our kind of life review before us, look at the timeline of our life, past, present, future, and past life now, out before us in our mind eye, and we're just going to connect with the angels from a heart-centered space and bring in love and healing. We're just bringing in beautiful energies, beautiful higher dimensional energies from our angels, and we're asking the angels to bring peace to all of these issues to help us remember the peace that is our true divine nature as a loved child of god as a loved child of the universe we are always safe our nature is love and peace and all fear is an illusion so we're raising our vibration now to that oneness to the state of the angels and from this oneness we are going to send ourselves healing uh, first we're going to start with past lives we're going to scan our past lives and ask the angels to send calming healing energy to any karmic challenges we may have faced in our past lives And just take a deep breath and be aware of any issues that may come up. You might have visions or you may have body feelings. Um, Just know that we're holding a healing space with the angels now through our intention and our co-creation with the angels. Angels are powerful healers, always waiting to help you. But they only only, um, help us if we ask them and they always work for our highest good. Angels are pure, loving spirit guides. I'm so grateful to work with the angels because their love is so radiant and feels so healing that it can kind of help us overcome any darkness that we may be facing in our life, any limitation, any fear, anything that is blocking our eternal, powerful spiritual self, our true identity. So now we're working with the angels to scan our past lives, send healing energy. I feel my hands buzzing. Um, Angels do radiate light. And sometimes when we work with angels, you may feel your hand chakra start to buzz and radiate light. Um, Our hands kind of can send healing. So if you want to hold up your hands and imagine your timeline of your spirit and send angel healing to that timeline, starting with the past life, now going up into this life, into childhood, a teenager, adulthood, young adult, go through your life and just notice where it needs healing. Was there a time maybe when your parents got divorced, you experienced an illness, uh, a loved one was lost, or anything that you may have experienced, just send love and healing to anything that was traumatic. The loss of a pet, just kind of hold up that energy, maybe some bullying at school or, or anything else you may have faced, an accident or trauma, just Hold that space with an open heart, 
with your angels with you and know we are sending love and healing to that. This is sacred time for you to check in and work with the angels to bring healing to your history. Because remember, your soul history is active within your mind and consciousness. Um, it comes out in different ways. It can come out as phobias, as memories, as fears. It can come out as, as worrying all the time or being fearful of the future. So that brings us to our next process. We're going to go into the future with the angels and we're going to send healing to our future, to any part of your future that you may be fearful of, maybe retirement or having enough money in the future, or, you know, your loved ones being with you or feeling healthy, whatever you're facing regarding your future, send angels to that now. And we're just kind of feeling the energy of that feeling the energy of your future and your consciousness and sending those time travel angels forward in time to bless your future. And so now these time travel angels are bringing up anything that we need um, blessings for. They're going to bring up certain moments in our timeline that maybe need a little extra healing. Just be open to whatever you see. Maybe it was a time in your life where you faced a loneliness or a difficulty or trauma and just connect with your angels and connect with their powerful healing remember angels are beyond time and space and can travel anywhere and in our reality we are kind of pinned down to linear time but really our soul is beyond time and space that's why we can kind of feel like we're reliving every moment of our life at once or that like memories can seem so vivid because we don't really function in this time reality. It is kind of a societal concept. So the angels of time travel now are helping us to heal ourselves and bring wholeness to ourselves throughout time and space, bringing back all parts of ourself and harmonizing all parts of our personal soul timeline. Um, and you may want to write that out on a piece of paper, your life review, now you can go to past life, this life and just take note of any areas that need healing where there was extra darkness where you can go back and maybe give yourself a boost of confidence or a boost of love and comfort. Um, I've often be, been visited by my future self. Um, I remember when I was a child, I was sick for a while and it was very hard on me and I kind of had this, you know, memory or kind of feeling that my future self visited me and told me to hang in there and everything was going to be okay. So remember, you can change reality through your thoughts and your intentions and the angels are your powerful guides. So I'm sending lots and lots of healing to your past, present and future now. And I'm helping you connect with these angels of time travel that really awaken us to the consciousness of our eternal self and also the healing tools that we have through working with the angels, through working with our intention, through working with prayer, through working with the light of the universe to say, you know what, I love myself and I'm going to call in universal healing. I'm going to call in millions of angels to bless this situation um, in my life because you know what everybody wants you to succeed everybody wants you to overcome the angels sing when you are thriving and happy on earth and you know that you affect every other soul on earth when you are happy when you are well adjusted when you are thriving and when you are connected to God and the angels are source um, when you feel that beautiful connection when you feel you are not alone that is very healing for the entire world. So let's bring that consciousness into us now. Open our heart to the realization that we are not alone, that we are safe throughout time and space. And send that protection now to yourself. And let's include all our loved ones in this healing. Let's include all of our loved ones now, sending angels to, to their self throughout past, present, future, and then we're going to send this healing to anyone who would like to accept it on the planet now. Thank you, angels. Um, remember, you can include anyone in your healings because when we include others, our own healing gets multiplied. And we are, you know, kind of community beings. We feel everyone. So it's really powerful for us to pray for the entire world and send that which we wish to receive, send that out into the universe now. So we're asking the angels now to actually go back and do a time healing on the earth, the history of humanity. We're doing that, and thus the history of the universe, going back to ancient societies, um, Atlantis, Avalon, and going out throughout the universe to wherever needs a timeline healing, 
and asking the angels to do their powerful light healing. Thank you, angels. Angels are bringing in cosmic rays of healing, um, beautiful higher dimensional energies. I'm feeling my hands buzzing again as light is shooting out to the planet throughout time. We're sending beautiful angel healing to the future of the earth, to a beautiful bright future for all of humanity in harmony with Mother Earth. Thank you, angels. Now I'd like you to pick one person in your life that you really feel needs healing, and we're going to ask the angels to send this timeline healing. Time travel angels are going to go with them and heal them throughout time and space. We're going to give this one person some really some extra healing today. Thank you, angels. Remember that angels are only bringing blessings to people. It is totally safe for you to say a prayer or have a healing intention for somebody because it's just sending them love and they have the right to receive it. Um, but I find most of all that if the angels kind of bring that intention to me or that wish to send someone healing, to send them angels, usually their soul is calling for it. Because when you have that angel connection open, people's higher self know that it's open and they might call to you and say, hey, Andrea, can you send me some angels too? So just be open because, you know, we're all communicating telepathically. We're, our higher selves are all communicating all the time and we know what's going on. So this healing feels really, really amazing. Let's go again to a part of your life where it really felt like you got stuck, where maybe you got um, really discouraged or beaten down or you failed or you, you know, whatever that is, pick that one time and let's send lots and lots of angels to that to bring healing to the whole situation, to lighten up the energy of that. Because I know the heaviness of memories can really wait on us. We can relive memories in the middle of the night and that's part of post-traumatic stress syndrome and things like that. So we want to work with the angels to kind of root out those really negative memories, root them out of our aura body and replace that energy with light and healing and love. Thank you, angels. So remember to connect with your time travel angels, write out your life review and meditate with the angels on any part of your life that feels heavy, that feels stressful, and send their love and healing. They work with us to multiply our love, multiply our intentions and prayers to neutralize all heavy energies from our past, present, or future. Thank you for listening. This is Andrea Dumbecki. If you're interested in having a private angel reading or energy healing, you can find out more about that at angelfairyhealing.com. I also have a YouTube channel with many healing videos, and I also have many classes on my website. Please remember to rate Angel Fairy on iTunes and also subscribe. I would also love to hear your feedback, and please let me know if there's a topic you would like me to make a podcast about. I try to focus on issues that many of us deal with. I have many ideas, and I would love to hear what you guys would like me to talk about. Thank you. You have been listening to the Angel Fairy Podcast with Andrea Dembecki. Stay tuned for weekly shows on connecting with the angels and fairies and receiving messages from the magical realms. You can connect with Andrea on her website at angelfairyhealing.com.